I challenge you to understand what happened to this country after Bonham died in 1985. Where Bonham died, we died, you know. Green made those remarks and issued that challenge to the journalist gathered at his home last week for a meeting with the Market Vendors Union. PNC stalwart and Guyana's longest serving mayor, Hamilton Green, expressed a concern from the moral dissent in Guyana. We have got to analyze the dissent, the moral dissent that took place over the past 20, 30 years. He said that he wishes for journalists to analyze the society with an emphasis placed on the youth. I would like to see young journalists do. He's talking to you, young journalists. As distinct from being a reporter, is analyze society as it is, particularly as it affects young people. Young people can't operate in vacuum. In his unprovoked litany, Green said that the late President Burnham had an unparalleled vision for Guyana. Burnham had a vision for this country. Burnham had articulated feed, clothes, and house long before other people did it. Green, who was also a former prime minister, said that Burnham was unable to fully implement his vision because of the formidable resistance he faced at the time. He had to deal with the local bureaucracy, he had to deal with international bureaucracy, because he did not want to see a country with people who look like you and I progress and make use for their benefit the natural resources of this country. After 53 years of independence, 28 years of the PNC rule, 23 years of PVP rule, and four years of a coalition government, Guyana, with all its resources, remains the poorest country in South America and the second poorest country in the Caribbean. Green said that the imperialists, who he identifies as the Chinese, Russians, and Americans, have always taken advantage of Guyana's resources. I'm going to use the word imperialist, include the Chinese, the Americans, the Russians. They're no different. Look at what the Russians are doing at, what's the place name? Russo. Russo, yeah. It's a disrespect and a disdain for our people. Green said that Burnham wanted to stop the raping of Guyana's resources, but failed. He said that Burnham's vision for Guyana was large. Burnham sought to put an end to that, and therefore he was a minority. Burnham was in charge of a country with less than a million people, whose ideas were those of a country with 100 million people. Green, who was passed for the presidency, which went to Desmond Hoyt in 1985, after Burnham died, added this. He was too bright, he was too ahead of his time. For Channel 2 Headline News, Wendell Jeffrey.